Hi there, I'm Richard and you're watching What The Haiku, the daily Twin Peaks haiku video. Except it isn't daily anymore and uh, it's not about Twin Peaks. Not today. I did try and think of another Twin Peaks haiku but uh, I've got to admit to you guys, I'm out. Uh, so in search of other inspiration, I decided to come to one of my favourite places in London, the uh, National Gallery. Look at some paintings and maybe uh, get the artistic juices flowing, maybe come up with a couple of haikus. So I've done, uh, well, yeah, well I've done some and uh, well here they are. Thanks very much. Enjoy. Okay, um, here's the first one, which is um, uh, a nice uh, Luca Giordano picture from 1680, which is called um, Perseus turning Phineas and his followers to stone. Uh, this is a bit from Metamorphosis. You can see him holding up uh, Medusa's head there. Right. Um, here's my little double haiku interpretation of that. Um, the bridegroom's judgment stays bold spears in stony hands. Time is stilled for them. Visage held aloft, serpent locks, a stare of death, statues of remorse. All right, that's the first one. Okay, yeah, this next one, which is by um, one of my favorites, William Hogarth. It's from about 1743. It's called uh, Marriage a la Mode, uh, number two, the tete a tete. All in disarray, loveless couple unconcerned save for selfish ends all right that's two cheers hello right this is the next one this is joseph wright of derby's um, experiment on a bird in an air pump from around 1768 uh, it's again another one of my favorites in the national gallery it's about to be obscured by people but never mind um, <clears throat> here's another double haiku within the glass jar the bird's life is sucked away for all to observe some fascinated some eyes flee the agonized spectacle of death. All right, there you go. And uh, that's number three. Let's see where I go next. All right, uh, number four. This is um, hands down my favorite painting ever. It's uh, by Joseph Turner from about 1839, and it's The Fighting Temeraire. Um, and uh, well, here's my double haiku, half face interpretation of that. Um, right, that's better, isn't it? Last rays of sunlight illuminate graceful masts, last touch of glory. Acrid smoke billows, unrelenting march of time pulls her to her end. All right, that's number four. Love a bit of Turner. Okay, and uh, number five, last one. This is uh, Paul Cezanne's Avenue at Chantilly, which is um, gorgeous, from 1888. Here we go. How many lovers walk the shaded avenue with fresh scent of leaves, stop to share a kiss, meander freed of all cares, naught but each other. All right, there you go, that's my five haikus. All right, just a bonus one. I happened to see this one on the way out and I uh, thought I'd do a quick one for this, something slightly more flippant. Now this is um, Edouard Manet's uh, Woman with a Cat. And just from the look on her expression, look on her face, you can tell it's the look of any pet owner. So uh, here goes, here's my haiku for this poem. Damned pet insurance and the cost of food so high. Worming tablets too. All right, cheers. That's the last of my master up. Right, well, that was that. Hope you enjoyed that. Um, now um, I'm in kind of Piccadilly Circus, we'll do some more stuff. Anyway, have a great day. I'll be back again sometime in the future. Have a good one. Bye-bye.